You wanna pop, please? Good morning. It's now 9.31. It's the first day of classes. And classes started, well, 9.30. <laughs> so I'm most definitely gonna be late today. Um, but you know, we're in England. I don't think things start on time. So yeah, I mean, I wanted to get up really early today um, to do a workout and take a shower, do some meditation, get some breakfast. Um, but something came in the way. At about 5 a.m. I woke up, couldn't sleep anymore. My stomach hurt. I felt like I was gonna throw up any second. Um, so basically for the next few hours I was just going to the toilet every few minutes. I didn't throw up, but I have diarrhea or a head. I don't know, I'm not sure. Um, you don't want to know anyway. Um, mm -hmm. Breakfast. Yeah. So I decided, well, I didn't sleep a lot. Let's postpone my alarm. Um, and now I'm late. But it's fine, I don't feel so bad right now. I thought I'd have to go to the doctor, but no, I won't. I mean, I could, but I won't. I think it's just something I ate yesterday. Maybe the, th the thing I got at Spoons. Maybe the water I drank. Although I didn't drink tap water yesterday. So, I don't know. Anyway, ah, I don't really know if I should be eating this because from, from the first bite my stomach is already like, dude, be careful what you put in me. This is the building I need to be at. I can't even say, oh, I didn't find the room because I've been in that room yesterday. But I'm going to go film this. I'll see you later. They don't seem to be doing any breaks. I have to take my own ones. Ah, oh, that's crazy. After two hours, a 15 minute break. God damn it, I need more breaks. Oh, also, I feel sick again. I am sick of this. I just can't handle it. I just can't. No. I told her I feel sick and I'm gonna head to the doctor's office. First day and already skipping class. Great, but I'm gonna go to the doctor's office for real, cause... I want to throw up, but I can't. So annoying. Ugh. Okay, change of plans. I'm not gonna see a doctor, cause I don't see myself taking a bus or taxi to Bedford and then queuing in the doctor's office and then him having to tell me that there's nothing wrong with me. So, just gonna go lie down until I'm feeling better and if that doesn't work I'll have to go to a doctor but that might work we'll see I hope that works I mean I don't feel that bad it's just that I don't know maybe it's the three hours of sitting in the lecture hall without having much sleep and my stomach is still a bit weird so yeah whatever it's just why is that door always open? I mean, handy for me, you don't need to unlock it, but... Uh. Those parps are so intense today. Ah. I've just had lunch. Because I figured I should eat something. Because my body is missing a lot of the salt and stuff. So I put extra salt on all my food. <laughs> Uh, I usually don't do that, but today I was like, yeah, I need that, I need that. Um, anyway, now I'm going back to the lecture hall. Well, I mean, I'm gonna try to sit in there and be somewhat productive by listening to him or her. I don't know yet. It's C++ programming, so it shouldn't be that difficult for me, since most of the people don't have a computer science background. But I do. Um, so it should be fine if I only pay 50% attention. But this time I went to the wrong building. 
and room. <laughs> All right, now searching for building 52. It's not like I'm already 10 minutes late. Oh man, this whole university is a labyrinth. It's so hard to find the rooms. In the end, I just asked someone and she brought me there and that took like forever. Let's turn left, then right, then left, then up, then... Oh. Anyway, found the room in the end. I was only like 15 minutes late. Uh, but it didn't really matter anyway, because this is the C++ module. And after telling me for two hours what C++ is, what object orientation is, I asked him in the break, is attendance compulsory? Because I've done that shit before. <laughs> and then he said, no, no, you're fine. If you, if you know the language, then it shouldn't be a problem and I should just come to the practicals where we do the numerical shit. All right, so I'll just do that and come to the practicals. But now I'm feeling fine, I'm not sick again. Um, so, yeah, I'm gonna run in this labyrinth some more. And that, that's the way I took to the classroom. Um, and meantime, just work on my computer, install a few things, and for instance, Visual Studio, so I can do C++ programming. But yeah, it's a good first day. And then I might leave early if I feel like doing that. All right, and you, go make a backup. I hope you're feeling fine as well. And then I'll see you tomorrow. Ah, it's it's good. I'm I'm happy again because in the morning I was like dying. Noon I was completely done, but now I feel better. <coughs>